Mister. You know, so far the new century confuses the hell out of me. No fool. But I guess that's the way of the world. Be well. So long. I thought I told you to leave it, Bubba. And I thought to myself, who this little girl thinks she's telling anything to? Uh, enjoy your drink in peace. <laughs> I ain't got no business with you right now. What that mean? For the last time, leave me alone. Or what? Ah! What was that? Get the hell out of here before she kills us all. You, you. Get out of here. John Marston! It is good to see you. <laughs> I thought I heard a rumor you was alive. Jim Milton, that you? Guess I didn't do a real good job of hiding my identity. <laughs> we didn't hear nothing about you. You... you killed a feller up by Roanoke? Sure did. I thought that sounded like you and Abigail and Jack. She... She's fine. <laughs> She was always so kind to me. I'm looking to buy some property. Beecher's Hope, west of Blackwater. I'm kind of a farmer now. <laughs> and you? Oh, you know how it is. Bounties mostly and some other stuff. Good and bad. Hey, you any interest in bounties? No, uh, I've gone straight. Huh? Sort of. <laughs> oh, it's legal. I'm usually. Then... Maybe. Come on, then. What? Where are we headed? Strawberry. Got on the run from New York. Good price for him. What'd he do? Rob a bank. With a gun? No, with a pan. He's an accountant, I think. Sounds easy. Come on. We got a bit of a ride. I know. Your telegram. You said you had something to discuss. I didn't think we'd be chasing down an outlaw. There's something else. What? Hey, Micah. Micah? I think so. I heard of someone who sounded like him uh, about a year back. Okay. We always said if we found him. I know what we said we'd do. That ain't changed. I didn't think I'd see any of you again after you left for the Yukon. Yeah, we came back. Didn't strike it rich, as you can see. But you're a rancher now. I got Uncle with me. We'll be okay. Uncle? Getting a scout by that gang out there might be preferable than living with him. Sometimes I think the same. His name is Nathan Banker, bald, 45. Okay. You hit up that way. I'll meet you in a bit.
You seen a... You seen a bald New Yorker? Name of Nathan Kirk, about 45? No, sir. If we get plenty of New Yorkers here. It's resort town, you see. The Adirondacks of the West, the mayor calls it. But <laughs> I can't remember any of the bastards. Okay. Ask in the general store or the post office. They tend to know who's in residence for the season, as we say. Season? Good lord. You, uh, you seen a fella? A fella from New York? Bald guy? Yeah. A few New Yorkers come here in search of the West. This one's a wanted man. I work for the government. Uh, s s sort of. His name's Nathan Kirk. Mr. Kirk? But he's so charming. Is he staying here? He's, uh, up in room three. I'm gonna go pay him a visit. It's government business. How exciting. Mr. Kirk! Mr. Kirk, you in there? Who is it? It's just a friend. Just a friend. Come on, open the door. I didn't do it. I didn't do it! Stop! Hey! That's Nathan Kirk! Go! Oh, got him? Oh, shut up! in here. Show us in the money. I ain't been paid yet. Send it on my behalf to West Elizabeth Cooperative Bank in Blackwater. Pay down my loans. Might make them happy to see I've got a boss. So I've got a couple of other leads I could use your help with if you're interested. I'm usually at the saloon in Blackwater. I need money pretty bad, so I'll come find you. <laughs> 